I was actually working and I got this crazy notion to come in and give blood. It's going to be tight for just a moment. Once I get that needle in there and get you on, I'll loosen this up for you. Okay. What's motivating you to keep on doing this? I guess it's needed. The blood's needed. And it's, uh, it's actually pretty refreshing. Some people don't believe that, but after you've given blood, you feel a little, a little lighter, a little more refreshed and energetic. That's about it, really. Do you believe that what you're doing is important in any way? I think so. Um, especially uh, in a, you know, a natural disaster, or car accident or whatever, when there's blood loss. It's good to have it on hand. There's no good substitute yet. I think it's a duty. It's part of being a good citizen. You know, it's part of being a good Christian as well as being a good citizen in the U.S. You said you come here how often? It's about every eight weeks. Yeah. So I've, I've exceeded 12 gallons at this point. Have you ever uh, pondered or thought about where, where your blood goes after you donate it? I have, especially after reading the fact sheet. You, you know, it kind of indicates that it could go multiple places. You know, it's one of those things, once it's, once it's out of you, it goes wherever it wants to go, and it's all right. One time I saw a truck, I can't remember whether it was community service or Red Cross, but it, it said blood, blood, something about blood donations on it, and it was going down 96 toward Detroit when my dad was in the hospital for heart surgery and we are both B negative. I wondered if he was gonna get mine. Thought that was kinda of in interesting to think about. Well, obviously I can't do it all myself, but, and we do need more donors than, we, than they currently have, I guess, because I have heard of surgeries being postponed because the blood supply of that type of blood was too low right then. How long do you think you'll continue donating for? As long as I can walk upright, I guess. I, or until they tell me no more.